Hey guys, hope you are doing well. This is uh, Patrick Egon. The channel is Try Teach Patrick Egon. Feel welcome. We do content in engineering, do content in uh, book publishing and writing, we do content in inspirational stuff and business, and finally we do content in mentorship. So today we are doing one content in uh, engineering, and it is a landscaping project. I want to show you of a small project we are doing on our ramp. Uh, it's a landscaping. And interestingly, this project entails recycling. We are recycling used concrete slabs to do stone pitching project in one of our house projects. So feel welcome, enjoy yourself, learn, share, and uh, remember to click the subscribe button so that we can grow together. Feel welcome, thank you. So basically this is our, the slanted side we are doing our stone pitching. Let me show you the sections we have already done, some stone pitching all the way there. We are going to go down there looking at what is happening. So these are the concrete slabs I'm telling you about. As you can see, this is recycled. They were, they were initially used to create a concrete path around our area of operation but because we changed our dimensions of our requirements we had to take them out so to avoid wastage we subjected them to another job which I'm going to show you so basically this is where we start we we clean the section we want to to apply the stone pitching then you break your stone your the concrete slabs into small units as you can see So this is a mapping out of your lay formula. We are doing an angle and we can see that rope going all the way up. So it's just as simple as that. When you have done, a, when you have cleared the section you want to do, you compact it as a to the requirement you want to get then from there using your construction guys you can be able to map out the section as you can see all the way up then you place your stone pitching material in our case this is a concrete slab as much as you want so maybe you can see this, uh, there is a section between the veranda and the stone pitching. That is where we will have our drainage line. As you can see it is slanting downwards, where, towards where the camera is going to. So that is it. Here we go. You can see this is a compacted section. Then you just place your concrete slab with the guidance of the of the mapping using the that particular drop. It depends on the whatever you want to use, but ensure that you have a datum which can be able to to guide you on how to place this and have some neat landscaping project in the hand. So let's go to the sections which have already been done that here we are. You can see we are starting to fill out the spaces between uh, the concrete slabs. You fill in and leave some space for now the, concrete, uh, the other sanding project.
So in our case, uh, we have some staircase. We have done some staircase to allow the people to be able to easily go up and down this uh, section because it has a slant and uh, we want people to be able to have a convenient use on the same section so let us have now a look on uh, a section which is already 90 percent complete maybe you can be able to appreciate the end product you can see it is clean So the only improvement you are going to use, you are going to implement is uh, may, maybe adding additional points where this can be able to breathe. But these are short sections so it's not something to worry so much about. The hand uh, plan is to do a drainage line here when we are going to do the finishing elements of this particular section. So guys that is how you can be able to re reuse you are concrete uh, slabs in case you want to remove them from one place to the other and that is how you can do your landscaping and a stone pitching project and make whatever place you want it to improve be beautiful and uh, be able to retain your soil which is important in any project that is uh, in a commercial application or a residential application so that is it for today i hope you enjoyed yourself thank you so much for joining me in this so until then enjoy yourself stay safe and remember to subscribe